Hey everyone, Grant Alexander here, and if you're like me, you don't know what to do with all your gloves. Stay tuned and I'll show you how I'm fixing that problem. First, I measured my door to get a sense of how big of a piece of wood I needed. Using my miter saw, I cut some scrap wood to 26 inches. I put a 45 degree chamfer on all of the edges. This gave it a nicer look and it removes the sharp corners. I will be installing rare earth magnets, so I used my drill press with an inch and a quarter Forstner bit to add some holes. I used the depth stop feature to ensure the holes were not deeper than the magnets. I laid out five pairs of gloves to get the spacing correct. The holes ended up being three inches from the end and then each one was spaced five inches apart. I'm using a 1 16th inch drill bit to pre-drill the holes. The entire piece got a good sanding with 120 grit and then I sprayed water to pop the grain. After it was dry, I sanded it again with 180 grit. To give it some color and add some protection to the wood, I coated it with Watco teak oil it's very simple to use, just wipe it on and then buff off any excess. The piece de la resistance for this project are these little spring clamps. Using a number six screw, I attach them to the wood. These little guys will be able to handle holding at least one pair of gloves each. This idea was shamelessly stolen from Austin, the high caliber craftsman, so make sure to check out his channel. The magnets are glued in place with CA glue. If you're not confident the CA glue will hold, I suggest using 5 minute epoxy. I would have used that, but I didn't have any on hand at the time. Lastly, to prevent the project from slipping down the door, as magnets are weak when it comes to shear strength, I added a small dab of hot glue to each of the corners. I hope you enjoyed that solution to my glove problem. If you did, I'd appreciate it if you give it a thumbs up. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. Now, this is actually my entry into the clamp challenge. Now, if you don't know what that is, it's a challenge put out by the podcast I'm on, Clamp. Uh, you can find it on all your favorite podcast players just by searching Clamp. It's a challenge that's going on until the 31st of July, and you basically take a clamp and use it in a way that clamps aren't used. So I took a little spring clamp, and it's holding gloves. Uh, there's been some great entries into the challenge. You still have 10 days to get your entry in. Uh, all the rules are at clampcast.com slash clamp dash challenge. Uh, you can go there. There's going to be a link in the description below. And until next time, cheers and have a great day.